Hey everybody, Coffee and Chaos here, and welcome back to episode 13 of our Let's Play series. I was, I should really write that down because every time I start an episode, I always question what episode I'm actually on. <laughs> uh, we'll get there eventually. Um, anyways, we're back. Um, last episode, we did a whole lot of work here in Crown Falls, got a lot of stuff built up. Um, I feel like this is in a spot where we can come back from time to time and build a little bit more of the town, expand a little bit more, maybe create some more goods. But for today's episode, we're going to focus here in the old world. And specifically, I think I'm going to start here in Tombola and try and build up our population here. Um, Tombola having the cotton fertility here, we can create our Ship cotton fabric and we can also create our ships. And we're going to take advantage of that now. Oops. And queue up a few more schooners. And after that, we're going to queue up a few clippers. Um, actually, that might have been a little overboard. Um, another thing I want to look at is I want to take a moment to take a peek at our... Oh, we lost a few ships here, didn't we? Oh, yeah, that's actually kind of an important one. Hmm... Right, so let's actually get you back using this one. And what was this other one? Kingfisher. Where are you? Hold up a minute. The Kingfisher. Schooner reporting. What in the hell was I doing with this? Oh, right. I was going to add some cannons here. Uh, while I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and drop that off to make sure that we don't lose the cargo. Ready for assignment. Because that absolutely will happen if I'm not careful. Aye. Drop that off. Stations. And we'll move them back aside. Cool. Now, I would like to head over here. And I'm sorry if I'm a little stuffy today, I've my allergies have been killing me, so I'm going to try and uh, keep pushing through the recording, but if I get a little stuffy, I apologize. So, we had kind of blueprinted this in a prior episode. I forget how many episodes it was. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and build this up now, get a good start to our little hacienda town here. With the radius of Haciendas being extended soon, I feel like this is actually going to be a lot of fun to play with now. We'll go ahead and build up our roads, build up the Yornalera houses, build up the Abrero houses, and we're out of wood, so it's going to be a little bit before we can do any more. Um, wouldn't hurt to get some Hacienda breweries going as well. And we'll be able to get a couple of specific farms, maybe get some beer going here. Um, do we actually require beer yet? Oh, not yet. We need to get up to 600 Abreros. Oh, uh, we could do that. <clears throat> the other thing I'd like to kind of figure out is where are we going to end up building our airship hangar? Uh, Macau has such limited space. I think that this one is just right out. Uh, Laiachi has good potential. We could consider this. And maybe we could actually consider having the dock... I somewhere owe my over here. Independence to the revolution. I'm sure you do. So yeah, this has potential as a location for the actual dock. Uh, let's see, kind of surveying the island. Hmm. Oh, we actually lost a fish oil factory. But thankfully, we've had some constructed. cannon towers coming in, or some uh, guns coming Hi. in, so Ship constructed. make sure to take advantage of that. Um, let's go ahead and add a few homes. And we got a resident quest. So many things going on. Wait. I'm sure there is a way you can help us thrive. Go Governor? 
Is that a typo or was that intentional? All right, they went. Oh, they would like ten Granolera resonances. Okay. <clears throat> well. There you go. What are they gonna of give me? Of course you could do it. Hey, 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 hey! All right. New museum item. Uh, let's check our production of goods. Yeah, rum is something that we're going to need to work on. So, yeah, I want to play with an idea. Ready for assignment? I'm thinking. If we look at these goods here, I would like schooners to be used for farmer goods, for Yornolero goods, and for, let's say, uh, what is it, shepherds in uh, Enbesa, and any of the basic, so first tier goods across the board, no matter what map we're on. So for this area, it would be fried plantains, ponchos, and where's rum? Rum. And we could also move our wood that way. We assist however we may. So we're moving some fried plantains. We also need to build up our docks here. We're gonna need a lot more storage on this island, so that's another thing I want to consider. Uh, let's see, we'll move gun out this way. Just say the word. Can you move further back? No. Ship constructed. All right. Away from new horizons. Trying to visualize to you going. how we're going to make the docks look. I think we could do... Oh, I can't quite fit a second one. All right, what if I move you one tile further out? All right, everybody goes one tile. Fill in that area. Yeah, the actual buildings in the middle. And we'll go ahead and prep up here. There we go. Ready. Let's move these gunboats over. Hey, what's this? Public mooring has a lot of little ships around it? I don't think I've ever noticed that before. Huh, that's entertaining. Let's go ahead and build these. Build the extra pier. So that will give us a little bit more throughput on our goods. And, you know, we could really go overboard here if we wanted to, but I'm not really there yet. Um, let's see. Do both of those islands have sugarcane? No, just this one. Okay, Macau. Right, I forgot. I had sit in the, the sugarcane farms. Just curious. If I just threw you here, can I get 64? No, nowhere close. Uh, what about over here? At this point, I'm not super worried about getting extra large farms. We can upgrade these later. 
once we get our uh, tractor barns. Although I did plan these out. I could plan this out as well. Ah. Get one more here. Ship constructed. I really need to increase that rum production. Ship constructed. Oh, 65 out of 64. Cool. That's going to be fine for now. I don't really want to break into... A piece deal. I don't want to break into the uh, Lumberjack Hut area. <clears throat> so that's going to get me some more sugar cane. And we're making 16 tons of sugar cane. We're using 12. Uh, and if I actually look at all islands, rum, 16 tons, that would actually be exactly what we need. Uh, I've got to find more production area. Um, move these off to the side there. We might need another upgrade on this warehouse. Alright, got our rum distilleries going. We did way more than we need because we want to make sure that we're covered. There you go. We're covered by another two tons. Now, we need to go back and add just a few more. We need two more sugarcane plantations. And actually, hey, would you look at that? There's one... There's two. Perfect. Now, we just need a little bit of population Ooh, here. Good. Uh, we need more Yornal Arrows. And I built myself into a corner. Not very smart, was it? Um, how am I looking on plantains? I've got 11 tons. Wait, 11 tons? How do you figure on 11... Oh, because we're, we're short. Going far without more. So it should be 12. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Alright, what if I actually move you guys over here? Let's just build a road out. Uh, oh, what's this? Yeah, do that. Get rid of you. Run you out. Gonna move these out. I'll twist them around in a second. We only need what? 10, 11 homes. Chip constructed. There we go. Uh, let's see. We've got to have a warehouse. That will get us <clears throat> just enough rum production. It's all prepared. Oh boy, what does he have? We need some money. Because I have seen how expensive the new Zeppelins are, and they are not cheap. Not in the slightest. Uh, yeah, we got a positive balance here, so that's good. How about over here? How 
Got a boxing arena for them. Could expand the town a little bit. Quite have enough wood. We're going to be on the edge of where we can reach. But we'll get a little bit more cash. We'll get a little bit more throughput of goods. Not much to really celebrate. These guys just need the hacienda as their town hall. They've got plantains. They've got ponchos. They've got rum. Okay. <clears throat> How are we looking on ships? We've got a few ships. So, I don't think I'm going to make this yet because we're going right past his damn island. Uh, in fact, let's see, where are the guns? Well, theoretically, we could bypass the guns. If I did this... Uh, how do I... I need to add more points. Um, if anybody knows in the comments, I've done it before <clears throat> where I had more points to play with. I know there's a way to do it, and I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah, it's not shift-click. It's not shift right click. It's not double clicking. Damn, I remember there used to be a way to actually add another point, I thought. So we could probably bypass his island entirely. Replace you with. Oh, not that one. Uh, you. Alright, you're gonna sell fried plantains over there. You are hauling fried plantains and ponchos. So you're picking up in Macau and dropping off in La Hayachi. Any extras that we have and any extra fried plantains will be sold. And then you... Wait a minute, where is it? You, right here. You're doing a balancing route because we cannot produce fried plantains in Tombola. So we're producing that, but then any extra ponchos in Tombola are coming back to La Iachi to be sold off. Right. And then you're the only island that has rum. <clears throat> so, uh, do we have any... We've got rum coming there, too. In fact, we... How did I manage that? No, no, no. That's supposed to be a balancing route. I did that wrong. Okay. And... Yeah, that actually... That's supposed to be a balancing route as well. I'm glad I took a look at this. Yeah, because we only want to maintain enough supply here to operate everything that we have. Okay. Uh, let's see. You're making corn. You're making corn. Right. So, let's go ahead and plan some other routes. And we're going to go from Laayachi to Tumbola. Alright. I want to move beer. Your people are starting to get sick. Oh, they're fine. Coffee. Bombins. Tortillas. And we're going to make this a balancing route. There we go. First few needs. Why did I add a ship there? I don't want to add you. I'd like to add... Let's see, I've got a few of these in the old world. I've got you. We're going to add the tube worm, but I need to get rid of his cargo, so hang on a minute. 
We have beer. <clears throat> uh, coffee. Bombins. And tortilla. Oh. Uh, tell you what. <laughs> Hats. Hats. Tortilla. Tortilla. Okay. That's close enough. Too many goods. I might have to start shortening these down. Uh, let's go ahead and put you there. And again, I'm sorry I'm so stuffy tonight. Hi. Not the uh, best time to be trying to stream. Trying to record. The sale. We're going to move closer, see if I can drop off the goods. There we go. And then I'll say play. He'll do a little spinny spin. He'll queue up next. Ready for a challenge. It'll all be good. Uh, let's add windows and concrete, which we have in abundance. You know what we actually could start working on is getting oil. We have enough stuff here. We could do it. So, what if we put you there? Move you there. Ignore You're the still mayor. in range. Get rid of all of that greenery. Alright, oil refinery. Wow, three. <clears throat> I wish that we could actually fit more. I don't think we can. Nope. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I don't know. Could we? Ah, it's so close. Yeah, I think I'm just going to move you back this way. I'm going to wrap you in a road. I'm going to build everything. Uh, we need... Get our rail. Oh, hang on. Yeah, that's a little awkward spacing. I guess we only need the one track for right now. That'll work. <clears throat> okay. Uh, do I want to upgrade you? Actually, as a matter of fact... Has ended. Yeah, I do. 250... Yeah, for a whopping 250 maintenance, we can now hold 1,500 oil. And what would it cost for an oil store? 50? To get another 200? We don't really need that yet. But we'll start building up and we can start exporting to the old world. Or to Cape Trelawney, wherever. Ready for a challenge. We got the guns made. We should be able to unload all, all of the way. steel. Sweet. Now we have a bunch of clippers to play with. Alright. Go back to our routes. Oh, we want to go ahead and copy... Where'd it go? Oh my gosh, did I never make that route? Did I somehow cancel it? No, no, I just never added it to a group. Okay, so you are in Tombola. So, Laiachi to Tombola. Great. Let's create another one. And same concept. And if we need to, we can edit this route 
to say move goods in a single direction, but we're not there yet. Um, hang on a minute. Oh, that's why I hit the wrong button. Uh, what was it? Bomb bins. No, bomb bins and tortillas. The people celebrate your leadership. Beer, coffee, bomb bins, tortillas, bum, 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 bum. Oh, check that out. Cool. Um, in fact, Macau is making tortillas, so we're going to pick them up there. We're going to drop them off in La Ayachi to build up a surplus. Uh, as far as the bomb bins go, we're making them there. We might change that at some point. Coffee, and beer. Yeah, that works. Let's go ahead and add the Nantucket. And maybe I can actually like shorten this up a little bit. Beer, coffee, uh, hats, tortilla. Excellent. So we'll do that. And again, I missed it. Macau. There we go. And San Martinello, which I still need to figure out how much population I'm putting there. Wouldn't hurt to have a little bit of population just to make up for the fact that I'm going to have coffee farms. In fact, I think I will just make that primarily a farming island. Um, you're going to move... Let's see. Yeah, right now, you're a balancing island. Yeah, you need both of those imported, honestly. <clears throat> Let's go ahead... I don't know how many obreros I plan on having there. Uh, do I have rum going there? I do not have rum going there. Let's do a trade route. Near to there. Any extra wood that I have, I want to come to Laiachi. And in Laiachi, I'm going to load rum. And here I'm going to load rum. And we're going to go ahead and add a schooner that's here. There we go. And this is wood and rum. <clears throat> reason we're trying to move wood there is the wood is going to be used for making rum. Need to make that the, the uh, wooden barrels. So easy enough to take excess from other islands and bring it back. Uh, San Martinello, San Martinello, San Martinello. Wait, where is it? There it is. And do I actually have my limit set? I do not. Let's do... Set a limit of 50 there. And we're going to go to raw materials and we're going to set a minimum stock of 25. And I'm honestly not too worried about the timber. We can just leave the one uh, no more space here. sawmill there do its thing. Uh, we could add a population. What if we run you over here? There you are. Put a warehouse there. Could even have the clay pit there, honestly. Cool. And I think I'll go ahead and add a little village here. In fact, you know what I could do? Could I actually just have a hacienda 
on this little island and have Hacienda buildings be the only source of governance here? You know what? We're going to try it. Why not? We're going to need a hot minute to build up on bricks, but let's actually recess you a little bit. Uh, let's say we had... Oh, wow, that's, uh, that's actually kind of epic. Ooh, look at that with the obreros. Say we had the obreros right up front. Uh, let's have... Gornoleros coming in from over here. Obviously, not all of this will fit right away. We'll have to work it in. All right. Going to add a space there. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. have our road going right across I think I want to do something like that down that way down that way down that way And perhaps we'll add a small colonnade there. And sort of bring the wall in. Yeah, I'd kind of like to wall this in, in one way or another. And as we expand the population, we can build out. Alright, let's actually get some bricks being made here. I could import them, but since I have everything I need right here with the clay, we'll go ahead and get that built. And we'll plan to have airship hangar over here, maybe? I don't know. We'll leave this blueprinted till we can actually see what goes where. But I do kind of like the idea behind this. As an alternative, I might delete some of these homes, the Yornalero Quarters, and actually turn them into Abrero Quarters. We could make this a compact um, Obrero only island and import most of the goods that we need and just have it be a little tiny money-making powerhouse. Which would actually be kind of cool, especially if we decorate it really nice. And tell me that's not epic seeing the, uh, the Obrero houses running right into the Hacienda quarters. Yeah, I'd like to really have the wall wrapping around. I'm going to have to play with this a little bit. Um, I'm also going to add... Just plain old Hacienda paving there. And you know what I might do? Oh, that's actually the edge. Maybe like right here I could add some fountains or something. Uh, let's see. That's two tiles wide. And the sheds.
I could do something like that. Kind of on the back. Eh, it's, it's okay. Are there any decorations in here? No, it's just the roads and the actual buildings. Eh. Placeholder design. We're going to leave that as a placeholder. We won't build this up this episode, but that's just something to, something to ponder. Um, for those of you that don't know, the Hacienda range is going to be doubled. Uh, just shy of doubled with the new expansion. The new DLC. So, something to bear in mind that Haciendas are going to go from this range of 40 to, I think it's going to be 75. So, imagine we're here. That'll damn near get you there. So, Hacienda will reach almost an entire island. I think with that, it'll actually make more sense to have the Hacienda Towns built up. Satisfy a few of their needs. Yeah, could be fun. Alright, Laiachi. What else can we do here? We've got our oil coming in. Um, what are some other goods that we really need to start I working always on? always believed. They want cigars. Ooh. They also need church. They need some of the Lord and Savior. So. Oops. They can go ahead and get their Jesus there. Uh, let's see. I really did build that in a worse location, didn't I? Because that's almost exactly where I would want to move my oil. Of course, there's oil here. The oil is just in a bad spot on this island. I can't really do anything about it. Well, we can't... The only other thing I could really grab here right now is Kauchuk. Which is here. We could plan a few of these. I don't want to do them right here, but I want to have them here as a reminder for later. Uh, Cowchuck would be used for when we make our penny farthings. Uh, we've got excess rum here. In fact, our rum is actually moving, so... I think something that would help us out a lot is to have a little extra storage on this island. So let's go to our harbor buildings. We can plot to have one right here. And maybe another on this side. Something like that. Uh, it also wouldn't hurt to build up the actual trading post. Get a sip of coffee here and think about this. Where is our actual tobacco? Oh, over here, Tombola. So Tombola desperately needs more obreros. Now, that'll help I a little a bit. Rebel if I, settled for this. I know, I know. Special here, but what do you expect? Alright, so we should get a little bit of schnapps. Played all the rancheras I know. There we go. And that means that we need potatoes. Oh, let's select policy. Dietary education, absolutely. Reduce those needs. Go ahead and place that. <laughs> I actually placed a gate there when I'm not probably not going to use it. Uh, 
There's our potatoes. Uh, how much do we need? Okay, that's actually enough. What's it going to give us? Seven coins? Okay, not bad. Hot sauce doesn't give you anything. Blah. A totally does. Something to bear in mind. Which... Gosh, we need hot sauce, too. Alright, let's get our hot sauce. Let's get our Atoli. Right? Anything else? You ready for beer? You're not ready for beer. Alright. Uh, some of these are backwards, by the way. Okay, how am I going to do this? You need... Spices. So, let's get one of you. I'm actually going to get rid of... Well... No, I'm not. I'll tell you what, we'll do... This. Just in solidarity. And add the fields. And we're going to trade you out for spices. So, it takes a minute to make that. And it takes you two minutes. So that means for one spice farm, we can actually have two hot sauce factories. How much hot sauce do I need? I need two hot sauce factories. <laughs> okay. Done. So, that'll take a little bit of time, but it'll ramp up. Now, a tolly. It takes one minute to make a tolly. And we need... One ton. So, for a tolly, we need corn and sugar cane. Uh, let's go ahead and get a farm for corn and a farm for sugarcane. <laughs> you hear that? All alpaca wool must be inspected by a royal inspector for fluffiness. I love listening to the little things that the people say. Let's go and get the sugar cane. Perfect. All right, we should be in motion. Hot sauce is there. And ever so slowly, we are ramping up and making spices. Uh, what else do our people need? Now, for one thing, I'm going to move this here. Eh... 30 Hacienda ra radius. Schnapps is being fulfilled. Hmm. It looks like we're a little shy on ponchos. Let's make that happen. Where am I currently making ponchos? No, really, where am I making my ponchos? Bricks, bricks. Am I crazy? It said we're making ponchos here, right? Yeah, we're making two tons. Okay, hang on a minute. Oh, 
Oh, there they are! They're right up in front. <laughs> totally missed it. Uh, where could I expand? So, I have oil here. I could go ahead and do it over here. That wouldn't be bad. Let's make it happen. Do a second field. And we'll move you over here. And build a second one. Alright, I had to put a random police station over here because of an uprising. I forgot about that. Okay. What else would you like? Um, they're ready for tortillas. Let's just drop a tortilla maker. We're going to go ahead and add a cattle farm somewhere. I'll tell you what, let's do it this direction. Silo built, and we're going to need corn farms, so we're going to build a pair of corn farms right here. I fully anticipate that I'm going to move a lot of this stuff around later, but it's a start. So that should start satisfying more of their needs. Uh, the only thing I don't have is coffee. And for that, it's a pair of coffee plantations. Eh. Screw it, we'll do a coffee plantation here. Add a few tiles there. Oh, you're kidding. Alright, that's gone. Uh, let's just take you... Yeah, just give me another bunch of tiles somewhere. We'll fill in as much of this area as we can. Oh, that's it. Okay. We'll add a road there and we'll add some ornaments in the corner. Promotion not possible. Oh, we're out of wood. Alright, not big deal. Okay, we've got... Maybe I'll just do something like this. Just do a longer field like that. Oof. Those are pricey. How much per field tile? 50 gold per field tile? That's nuts. I did not realize it was that expensive. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We're swimming in money. We're, we're bringing in a huge balance. We're, we've got a huge balance of coins sitting there. We're fine. Where is our wood production, though? Uh, did we have it off to the side here? Yeah, we did. Yeah, there he is. Still working? Yeah, it looks like it's working away. No more space here. We got plenty of sails built up. So, yeah, we're just going to have to let that sit before we have enough wood to do anything. And same thing goes for the actual obreros. Are we building up on tortillas? We're building up. We're getting there. How about the rest of your needs? 
Let's actually fast forward for a couple minutes to see if we start to get a little bit more population. The people celebrate your leadership. All right, looks like we're actually very, very close to being fully satisfied and having full Yornalero houses. Obrero houses are making it pretty close. And we actually need coffee. So let's see if we can satisfy that. Uh, we're just shy. The epidemic left building the Abreros, but that'll actually get us there. Build the coffee roaster, build the coffee plantation, and with any luck, all of these goods should stay satisfied. Is there anything we're not satisfying? Well, rum is coming in from another island, so that's fine. Plantains are coming in from another island, that's fine. Uh, hot sauce makes no money. <laughs> Why in the world would they make hot sauce that... Like, make that little profit? Like, honestly, the only way that you can make a profit with hot sauce... Is if you literally had your population maxed for it. Or, Still if you only, only gave it to the Abreros, that's an option because they give you more. Yeah, I don't know. That's just weird. Let's say we go ahead and add a few more Abrero houses. putting us right on the edge. And we're over the edge on Atoli. Tell you what, can I piss these guys off? You know, that might be the way to go. That gets us there. And it certainly makes more of a profit. Let's actually grab a few more homes. What in the world? Why is it copying... Oh, it's because the roads are considered part of the Hacienda... That's so weird. I'll tell you, some of the design choices that they made with the Hacienda are just awkward. It's one of those things I want to love so much. Gonna follow that same new milestone thought process for how I did the other colony. All right, they would like bomb bins, which we really can't give them here. Um, no, we could if we bring corn in and we make the felt and we make the bomb bins.
Uh, just need the wood. There must be input for output. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's fine. Do we have enough apaca wool? We do not. Uh, let's fast forward, see if we can get just enough timber. An explosion in one of your factories. Oh, are you kidding me? A fire broke out. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's less Ceasefire than good. Has ended. Uh, if you guys could Look train up a Look little bit out. faster, I I'm trying. Oh no! Well, yeah, save the Abrera homes too. Don't let them burn down, they're more valuable. I have stockpiles of these goods. There you go. Let's mobilize some more. Oh, we can't. Oh no, we don't have enough happiness. We're beans in the roasting tin! <laughs> oh no. Yeah, we lost one home. We're likely going to lose two more. Yeah, that's not good. I was not aware that those would catch fire. Well, I guess we're going to end this episode in disaster. Alright, everything's put out on this side. I think we have one Abrera quarter and one Yornalera quarter. I've lived enough to know your kind. Uh... Oh no. We're just we're just chasing the fire around, just guys. More heart. You know, in the meantime I could add a chapel. We'll have need of the priest shortly. Oh <laughs> just no, oh no, no. Faster, please. If it makes it around the entire block, I won't know what to do with myself. Uh... They got it. Okay, that's it. Fire's done. Good grief. The fire left ruins behind. But we already fixed it, so we're okay. Oh, that was... That was something, guys. That was absolutely something. Well, I think that just about does it tonight for what we can do before the actual drop of the DLC. So, I'm going to go ahead and call it here. Tomorrow, we'll get the DLC fired up. We will see what we can do in a recording tomorrow night, see if we can figure out what the deal is. Hopefully, 
whatever's going on with my sinuses will be cleared up so I don't sound so stuffy and I'll hopefully be able to talk a little bit more than I was able to tonight. Uh, again, just want to say thank you to everybody who has uh, given the channel a sub. We are just a little over 200 subs away from hitting our goal of 1,000 subs. So that's huge. Um, also, I have unlocked community posts. Uh, that's an unlock that happens at 500 subscribers that uh, I didn't think it happened till 1,000, but People it just celebrate took a little leadership. while for it to actually take uh, so that I could actually use it. So we're there. We're able to do that. Uh, you'll see some posts for me. I've I actually put a couple of posts up with a uh, uh, few polls. So be sure to keep an eye out for those. I'll be asking questions on there, communicating with you guys through that. Uh, too many changes, I hope. And I guess we'll do one last minute change. And good. Nobody's unhappy. So yeah, thanks for being here, guys, and I will see you tomorrow night with the start of, what is it, uh, Empires of the Skies? Empires of the Skies. Empire of the Skies? I don't know, plural somewhere. <laughs> we're going to have airships, damn it, and we're going to have mail, and we're going to have plenty of other things to play with. Lots of opportunities to really optimize our trade routes, which is something I really want to spend time doing. Uh, I might do a little optimization off recording. Uh, let me know if that bothers you guys or not. I know a couple people really like when I do everything on screen. So tell me in the comments if that's something that you really mind or not. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.